he will tell you that he went into a hallway, and again, he'll, we will show you this um, with crime scene photos, et cetera. But he basically positioned himself so that he could see both Hannah and um, Dana. He could tell that Dana was on her phone because it was kind of lighting up her face. Um, he will tell you that she made a noise that he said he kind of froze initially, but she made a noise which um, jolted her out of it. And um, Kylie started crying. And he says he took two quick steps into Dana's room and shot her um, twice and then immediately rushed back to where Hannah was. And he will tell you that Hannah obviously heard him because she was laying with her left side to the doorway and turned to look. She had been nursing Kylie and um, saw him. He doesn't believe she recognized him, uh, but she saw him and he shot her. He will tell you that after he shot her, he rearranged her body on the bed so that Kylie could nurse uh, if she wanted to. And um, he will say that he went back into Dana's room and shot her more times because she was um, making noises. Um, and then he will tell you that he went out of the door that led from Dana's room into the kitchen. And when he opened the door, um, his dad was standing there with the 40 drawn, probably in a just in case, you know, situation. And George was still behind his father um, guarding little Chris's room. He will tell you that he then, Jake claims that he then went to little Chris's room and also shot little Chris, who had never woken up. He was asleep at the time he was killed. 